Alright, so I discovered this asteroid. Let's see. Is there another one? Here in the asteroid belt. Another one? Here in the asteroid belt. Usually it'll just, you know, easily show itself. No, I guess not. Alright. June Talma. And at least, I also like, not just, look at this, they also give these descriptions and histories on these p different planets. Oh, no one hiding here in the dark. Alright, here's the ship. The Ontar Ontario. The Ontario is a Kowloon Ontario. Ontario. The Ontario is a Kowloon class modular conveyor of human design, configured for mixed freight and passenger hauling. It is making a hard burn for the cover of an asteroid cluster. Registry private owner Citadel Station. All right, let's get aboard and uh, save this chairman from these uh, biotic uh, fanatics. All right. Let's bring Caden and Ashley. As it auto saves, and everyone renders in, including. Uh, it's like from here I can see. Oh, nice detail in Caden's armor. I can see the squares. Up, oh, got an enemy, enemy on the radar. Okay, got our weapons out. Is there anything here to ha- Oh, yes there is. Uh, just open it. Ooh. Ooh, let's check these out. Uh, Ash- uh, Oh, man. Not even close. <laughs> I was like, is that good? No, it's not. Oh, and these aren't even close to what I have right now. Still have don't have a second weapon upgrade. What about Caden? Nah, he's already got the same one here. This one's pathetic. <laughs> what about Ash, though? Eh, I'll go ahead and give that to Ash. Why not? Why not? Is there anything over here? No. Okay. There's not really any negotiating at this point. As soon as they see you, they're gonna be like, "Ah, oh, blow up the ship!" Kill them all! Intruders! Kill the hostage! See what I mean? Countdown! Three minutes! We have three minutes to get I to the get to them before they kill the, kill, uh, the chairman. There's a guy I'll right over here. You. Yes, there is. Let's hurry! Ah, I got stuck. I will destroy you! Phew! <laughs> I shrugged it off. You ain't gonna hit me with any bio biotic attack. Down. All right, let's 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 uh yeah sheath our guns. See how it is? You write letters and everyone ignores you. Force is the only thing people appreciate. That's not so true. So how about if I kill Chairman Burns and finish no, no, the show? No, 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 no Please, need for that. I was trying to help you people. Just calm down. Let's not do anything we're all going to regret. Why not? What have we got to lose? Since the chairman here decided that we didn't get reparations, we've got nothing left to live for. This isn't the way well, to go about it, though. Seeing you all, it, it, it's clear that you all deserve... You had your chance. Some L2s are nearly crippled from side effects of the implants, but you voted against reparations. You don't get it. You need him. Think about this. Burns is the one man who can help you. Yeah. Yes. If you release me, I can take another look at the reparations request. If you kill him, that chance goes what? away. We're supposed to trust you? Caden, talk I'm to I'm an that. L2 like you. Trust me. The commander can make sure that Burns follows through. Thanks, Caden. Sure. You promise us freedom and say everything will be fine, but as soon as we surrender, you'll double-cross us. <laughs> this is as much as you, as you get. I'm telling the truth. I'm not promising to let you go. All I'm saying is that Burns will take another look. Right, Burns? Absolutely. I had no idea that the L2 biotics were this desperate. If I'd known, the reparations will come. For whatever it's worth, I promise that. Come on. You're right. I don't want to die. Maybe something will happen this time. We surrender. OK. 
okay. No Thank more you, bloodshed. Commander. I thought I was dead when they took me. I'll see to it that the reparations discussion is reopened. I didn't know they were so desperate. Just doing my job. A Fifth Fleet cruiser will be by shortly to pick you and the prisoners up. Phew. Glad we got that resolved. And I like that you can solve these things uh, through diplomacy. That you don't have to do it through a gunfight every time. That you can solve it just by talking and diplomacy means. Adds a very uh, passive, non-violent uh, feel to it when you can do it that way. Up, oh, secure crate. <laughs> While you guys are under arrest, I'm gonna start looting your stuff, hacking crates and stuff. <laughs> See if we can get some nice equipment here that you guys have stashed away. You're prisoners, so it's all property of the Alliance, which is therefore my property. <laughs> I got polonium rounds. Ooh, let me check. Uh, let me check. Uh... Oh, I already have those. Never mind. <laughs> uh, I'd rather give that to Liara than Caden. I'm not going to have Caden with me that often. But there will be occasion. You know, I'll, I'll most likely have Liara with me more often than Caden. Okay, so we now we have this resolved. Got this taken care of. Yeah. Complete. You boarded the freighter and convinced the bio fanatics to surrender peacefully. Chairman Burns has promised to re-examine his decision regarding payments to L2s in the wake of the kidnapping. <laughs> well, it worked, but... Could have been done a different way. That's all I'm saying. Alright. Yeah, help uh, Nasana find her sister... Kohoku's been giving you coordinates, so we have to go to the Yanks, Yangtze, or Yangtze, I'm, I'm not sure how to pronounce that, system in the Voyager cluster and investigate Cerberus activities on Binthu. I'm going to have to help the Admiral. Alright, let's leave. Glad we were able to uh, save him. And, uh, be able to bring the to bring them in without them losing their lives. If I didn't have Caden with me, it wouldn't have made a difference. But it's just cool that there's that extra piece of dialogue there. And that's why I like find, finding out when you play these kind of games uh, multiple times is when you try to bring squad mates on different missions. You then find out different pieces of dialogue that can be uh, that can be had. And uh, that's not just in this game. That's also in the second and third game. And that's a that's a, that's one of the fun things about this series is uh, finding out. Okay, so if you bring this squad mate on this mission, uh, then then this person says something completely different, or it even affects the mission, stuff like that. Okay, so before we uh, tackle another mission, now let's see if there's anything new that anybody can say. Caden, do you have anything new to say to me, buddy? Anything at all? Anything you need, Commander? Just trying to get a sense of where the crew's at. Thoughts? I've wasted enough of your time no. for now. Commander? Ugh. Doesn't have anything new to say. What about Liara? I thought, no, nope, nothing new in my locker. Liara, sweetheart, do you have anything to say? I get the feeling you want to ask <laughs> nope, me something, Commander. Nothing important. I should go. Goodbye, Shepard. <laughs> okay, no one's got anything new to say. Up, oh, up. Oh. Frame rate got dropped there for a couple of seconds. Like I said, this game is buggy and glitchy. You guys have seen this game freeze on me twice already in this playthrough. Okay. Let's check here. Assignments. Voyager cluster. Message coming in. Huh. Patching it through. Another message, alright. 
Thank What's you for up? dealing with the hostage situation, Commander. Oh, thank you. Chairman uh, Burns was quite impressed by the way you resolved the situation peacefully. Huh. Your assistance above and beyond the formal duties has been noted, Commander. Fifth Fleet out. I love Admiral Hackett. He is just so awesome. Not just in this game. You will you will meet him in the uh, and you'll actually see him in the second and third game. I don't think you actually ever see him in this game, but you will see him in the second and third game. <laughs> just <laughs> spoiler. The Yangtze system, Voyager cluster, Amazon. All right, let's go. Let's save Kohoku. 